Now you have driven all the highway. <laughs> Welcome to Retro Arcade Reviews. My name is John, and in this episode, we will be reviewing the arcade classic and one of my all time personal favorites, City Connection. City Connection is a side scrolling platformer that was developed by Jaleco in 1985. In this game, you play as Clarice a driver who tries to leave a mark around the world by painting every section of the road by driving over it. You must avoid stray cats and the police who stop at nothing to try to put an end at your attempts of worldwide vandalism. As with a lot of arcade games, the game is pretty simple and fun. Once the game begins, the car doesn't stop, it just goes. It doesn't speed up either. Your only options are to turn, jump, and pick up oil cans to shoot at cops. You can also perform a super jump to get to higher platforms. If you're able to pick up three balloons, you automatically warp to the next stage. There is no ending to the game, so it's all about seeing how far you can go or how high of a score you can get. One aspect I find that makes the game enjoyable is the catchy tunes, which basically are variations of a famous Tchaikovsky piece that I can't pronounce. City Connection was ported over to the MSX, ZX Spectrum, and the NES. I owned a copy of this game for the NES, so there's a heavy nostalgic factor in it for me. But I can assure you that this won't affect my overall review of the game. I can be fairly objective. In saying that, I give this game a 5 out of 5, a must play, a hidden gem, play it. Really, no, but for real, give the game a shot, play for a couple of minutes if you happen to run into it on main. It's really cool game, it's really fun, and you know, it's, it's kind of a, you know, it's, it's a good game, it's a good game. I say play it.